doing a scenario with another um, mom here in Florida where she's about to get her paycheck or the husband's going to get the paycheck. The same day they get paid is the same day they have to pay their mortgage. So what could confuse people is, oh, should I take a portion of my paycheck, leave it in the checking account, pay the mortgage, and then put the rest in the HELOC or the personal line of credit? No. The first move is always dump everything into the line of credit first to avoid that interest from accruing higher and higher. And then that same day, you're extracting money. Okay. So something that you can do if you know your bills really, really well, okay, is you can extract money the day before you get paid out of the line of credit. Let it sit there in the checking account. And then when you see your paycheck come in like right in the morning, like Friday morning or whatever, put that transaction, boom, make a transfer, boom, right into the line of credit. I promise you're not going to pay anything in interest. It's going to be like a quick like that. It's a wash. Okay. And it'll read, boom, his balance or her balance drops. You satisfy that month's payment. Okay. And we keep going. All right. So going back to most important month, right, is the first month when we do velocity banking, which in this case, it was, it was January, made that first chunk, putting the uh, income back in, taking expenses out. But now we have an opportunity to make a second chunk, like immediately, okay? We have the space, which is all right. And the other factor is we make good money, okay? So when I'm talking to people that make like 5K or under, unless you got money sitting in savings or in other locations, trust me, I am not going to be advising you to make back-to-back uh, -back chunks. I never want you maxing out the personal line of credit, okay? Only reason why I have that put in place, my little rule for me personally, is just in case something goes down, that at least I got extra money in that line of credit because technically that line of credit is my savings account, okay? If emergency happens, I pull from there first. I don't use my cash first. I pull from the line of credit first and then I replace it with my savings. Quick transaction. It's a wash. And it doesn't cost you any interest to do that. Boom, boom. Real simple. All right. 